We're unboxing the February 2023 Keto Crate right after this. Welcome to the February 2023 edition of the Keto Crate unboxing. You can click the link in the description box below to get a discount on your very first Keto Crate or stick around to the very end to see how you could win your very own Keto Crate. But the thing is, do we even want this Keto Crate? We don't know. We have to find out what's inside and we're going to do that right now. First, Chipmunk peanut butter cookies. I've had Chipmunk products before. I really enjoy them. This is a peanut butter cookie. Serving size is one cookie. And there are 170 calories. You guys, they are they are doing it with the packaging these days. Like, okay, 170 calories. There are 14 grams of fat. There are 20 total carbs, three fiber, and then seven grams of protein. So there are also 14 grams of allulose, meaning that there are three net carbs in this. I feel like peanut butter is one of the easiest keto cookies to make like peanut butter in itself might be kind of keto inherently keto and the flavor is really good and really helps balance out any erythritol and sweetener so i look forward to trying this next ratio keto coconut almond crunchy bar i see these in the grocery store these remind me of those you know those bars like are they nature valley are those the ones like the really crispy crumbly bars uh, I, these remind me of that coconut almond. I might've had this before, but it's been a while ago. Nutritional facts, serving size, one bar, 240 calories, 17 grams of fat, nine total carbs, three fiber, zero sugar alcohol. So, and then 12 grams of protein, but it has two net carbs. So I'm assuming there's some allulose somewhere in there. The ingredients are almonds, pumpkin seeds, soy protein, isolate, coconut oil, erythritol, whey protein. This actually isn't that bad. Next. Ah, oh, Keto Farms Blueberry Vanilla Cashews. I absolutely love these. The serving size is one container, 120 calories, 10 grams of fat, 13 total carbs. Jeez. I mean, cashews are like the carbiest nut, but jeez Louise. Seven grams of erythritol and one fiber. That means there's five net carbs and then three grams of protein. So the ingredients, cashews, natural sweetener, which is erythritol and monk fruit, butter, blueberries, molasses. I mean, these taste delicious. Next. Oh, shrewd food keto dippers, dark chocolate. I don't know if I was really looking for a dark chocolate version of these. Uh, the milk chocolate one worked just fine. Regardless, Serving size, one container, 140 calories, 11 grams of fat, 13 total carbs, seven fiber, and four sugar alcohol. Does that mean one net carb? Do I not know how to do math? Oh, two net carbs. That's what it is. Uh, and then eight grams of protein. Okay. I'm not, I'm not mad at this. I'll be interested to see what these taste like. Dark chocolate for me is usually kind of bitter, but that's okay. Next, Genius Gourmet. Uh, keto bar so we love their chips their tortilla chips and so whenever we see something else from genius gourmet i'm glad to see it this is creamy peanut butter chocolate peanut butter and chocolate is like my favorite flavor combination so this this is has a lot to live up to so serving size one bar 180 calories 14 grams of fat there are five total carbs i mean that that's great for this bar to just have five total carbs and there's one sugar alcohol, geez Louise, so is that two net carbs? And then 10 grams of protein. Is it only two net carbs? That's crazy. Okay, what are the ingredients? Okay, keto vegetable fat blend, so palm oil, shea oil, and peanut oil, protein blend, and then peanut butter, polydextrose, hydrolyzed collagen. Now we're getting into some words I don't really like, but like, oh, manufactured exclusively for Genius Gourmet product of Canada. Well, hello, Canada. Next. Oh, 
Chalk Zero, yep, it's official. We want the Keto Crate. Chalk Zero Double Dipped Almonds. These are the Milk Chocolate Style and Caramel Toffee. Oh, first of all, the coconut versions of these are delicious, but the Milk Caramel Style Toffee, also delicious. Okay, so serving size is, there's three and a half servings per container. These come individually wrapped with like two little nuggets or almonds, I would say. Uh, and so there are three and a half servings per container. Each serving is 130 calories, 10 grams of fat, 14 total carbs, nine fiber, and two grams of protein. Like, these are just delicious. The ingredients, chocolate milk confection. So that's chocolate liquor, cocoa butter, whole milk powder, um, and then non-GMO resistant dextrin, almonds, vegetable oils. Okay, but palm fruit oil, coconut oil, cocoa butter. Okay. I mean, I'm, I'm going to eat them. I'm going to love them. Next. Oh, it's a meat stick. It is a singing pastures roam stick pork for the planet made with pasture rage. Raged. That's I feel enraged with a pork stick. Okay. Made with pasture raised heritage pork, uncured bacon. Okay. Well, if this is going to taste like bacon, I'm not going to mind it too much, but they rarely do. It has the ingredients, 100% pasture-raised, pork, water, uncured bacon. Yeah, but it doesn't have the nutritional information on here. So I'm sure if you go to singingpastures.com, you'll be able to find the nutritional info. Next. Mm. Feels like pork rinds, and it is. Epic pork rinds, barbecue seasoning, less than one gram total carb per serving. And there are five servings in this container. I mean, this is a retail size bag. Like, I mean, you can get this at Whole Foods. Love the value of the Keto Crate. 80 calories, six grams of fat, less than one carb per serving. But remember, there are five servings in this bag. So I would count this three to four carbs. But I mean, this is a lot of food. Uh, and then eight grams of protein per serving. The ingredients, pork skins, pork fat, salt, paprika. Yeah, like a whole bunch of other spices. This is, this is a pretty, pretty clean pork run right here. Next. Oh, this is heavy. Oh no. I don't know if we have enough stuff to make this. Ah, oh, but I love pure brownie mixes. So organic sugar-free brownie. This is a mix. What you need is two eggs. Lord, in this economy, two eggs? No, absolutely not. Uh, and then one half cup of coconut oil or melted butter. Honestly, we might not have two eggs. That That is really going to determine whether or not we can make these. But if, I mean, if these are the same that I've had before, these are delicious. Like, I already know these are a tier one. I absolutely love them. I mean, I'll see if we have the ingredients, but mm. comment down below. Do you still be buying eggs out there all willy-nilly? Like, are you rich, I'm assuming? But this stuff's delicious. And once again, like, this is like, a good value like this cost maybe what like seven to ten dollars in the store these cost what four to five dollars at whole foods like all of this together the keto crate is delivering value finally let me see yeah it is finally oh good good coconut crunchy keto bars milk chocolate with fibers and sweeteners okay so good good i think i've seen do they make a jam i think i've seen their jam I don't, I don't know if I know they made bars, uh, non-GMO, free from maltitol, no added sugars. Okay, I'm okay with this. Is it a flavor? Is it just milk chocolate with fibers and sweeteners? Okay. For one bar, 150 calories, 12 grams of fat, 16 total carbs, seven fiber, seven sugar alcohol. So that's two net carbs and then three grams of protein. These ingredients, our number one ingredient, coconut, love it. Uh, number two, milk chocolate with fibers and sweeteners. Okay, cocoa butter, inulin, mm, oligo fructose. I feel like that could be a blood sugar spiker. Cocoa mass, whole milk powder, skimmed milk powder, sweeteners, erythritol, stevia extract, soy lecithin, natural flavors, polydextrose, mm, more sweeteners, okay. Soy crisps, 
Soy protein, tapioca starch. I mean, no better or worse than anything else we've seen come in a package here. So just like, you know, test your blood sugar, figure out where snacks fit into your life and go for it. But regardless, I didn't know this existed. So I'm happy that the Keto Crate delivered it to my door. Okay, are you interested in winning this Keto Crate? Comment down below, let me know which products you have tried or haven't tried or would be most excited to try. Uh, or you can use the link in the description to get a discount on your very first Keto Crate. Skip the line, don't, don't leave it up to fate. Go ahead and make your own fate and use the link in the description to purchase your very first Keto Crate at a discount. But if you want to leave it up to chance to see, be sure to catch us on our next video, Smash the Crate. That's the monthly series where me and my husband and my mother, we're gonna try all of these, perhaps and the brownie batter. And that really makes me sad because I love that stuff. Um, but we're gonna try it to let you know what we think about it. And we'll also tell you the winner of this month's Keto Crate. Until then, we gotta get smashing. Bye.